Welcome to the BlitzQT BlitzPay Wallet tutorial. We would like to introduce you to our BlitzQT and BlitzPay wallets. The Bitalyze desktop wallet is very easy to use. The wallet includes standard features such as sending or receiving coins, as well as extensive functionality to send messages between users. The main window contains tools for operating the wallet functions and also informs us about the number of active connections to the Blitz network. We can also find here information about staking. Blitzcoin offers 10% interest while staking your coins. While staking, you are also supporting the Blitz network. The top toolbar includes help tools, information about the version of the wallet, as well as the debug window that allows you to open the console to control the wallet with typed commands. Now before you start to send and receive Blitz coins, it is very important to set your own password. You can set your password in the top bar. The password should be difficult and complex with a long string of characters and numbers. Once the password is set, your wallet will then ask you to restart it. Unlocking the wallet allows you to stake as well as include the possibility to make transactions without having to retype the password for every transaction until you restart your wallet. The top toolbar includes tools for wallet configuration. It is important to set the minimum fee to the added transaction when sending coins to another address. The minimum recommended fee is 0.01 Blitzcoin, which will ensure that your transaction will be confirmed quickly. Now, choose Receive Coins. Here you will see a list of your addresses and public keys. You can change a label for each of your addresses if you want to name them. Labels are visible only to you. The receiver will see only your public key. It is recommended to create a new address for each new transaction, which is intended to prevent others from knowing your total balance. Now to receive coins, we need to give our address to the sender. Let's copy our address, and in this case, we'll use the BlitzPay wallet to send coins. The BlitzPay wallet is the extension for Google Chrome, and it also works on Android devices. In contrast to the BlitzQT, BlitzPay does not require a full blockchain data download. It is very easy and intuitive to use, and allows us to configure important functions in the blink of an eye. It's ready for operation. Let's choose the option Send, and paste the copied address in the Send to Input field. Let's set the amount of the transaction, press send, and it's done. The BlitzQT wallet pop-out window will show information about the incoming transaction. Go to the BlitzQT wallet and choose the Transactions tab. Here you will see the list of send and receive transactions. Remember that you should back up your wallet and keep your backup in the safe place in order to restore your balance at any time. You can find Backup Tool in the File tab placed in the top menu. Sending coins from BlitzQT Desktop is just as easy as receiving. Let's copy our address from the Blitz Pay Wallet and then choose the Send tab in the Blitz Wallet. Paste the receiver's address into the Pay To field, choose an amount, and press Send. Information about the sent transaction is added to the list, and our address from BlitzPay will soon receive the transferred coins. But unlike the desktop BlitzQT wallet, generates a new public key for each new transaction. Earlier public keys still remain, and we can still receive coins sent to those addresses. For more information, visit the official website of the project Bitalize. We wish you a pleasant experience when using BlitzQT and the BlitzPay wallets. Thanks for watching.